Hello everyone, Cheshire the Cat, living free and streaming hard. Wait. Hello everyone, Cheshire the Cat on the scene. With more, the world ends with you. How are we all doing today? It's just easier on my own. Nobody else's baggage, nobody else tying me down. People aren't meant to figure each other out. My thoughts exactly. I'd rather just get rid of them. Uh. Huh? What? Same as you, Neku. Those headphones you wear, wear say it all. Yeah, so what? I don't like other people. I've got no use for the next world over. So don't come barging in on mine. My own world's all I need. Unless... What about Shiki? Well, you look at the time. And still no mission. It's probably too late now. The little hunt will have to continue tomorrow, too. Huh? The signal's disappearing. But before I was reacting to these pins, right? It's still picking... Picking mine up faintly. There was a whole bunch of them before. Maybe they added up to a strong signal? So that's why cat- So why cat's pin, anyway? That's not what I'm looking for, I know that. Okay. Then what are you looking for? Well, put simply, I'm looking for what this tracker is tracking. Oh, what the- Oh, that's real helpful! What the hell is this kid after? Roaming the streets. Wait, so we're still in day three, though, aren't we? The fourth day. Wait, beg the pardon? But there was no mission. Huh? <laughs> yes! I win! This isn't fair, Neku. When did you suddenly become a tin pin expert? <laughs> and why should I answer that? Uh, how about because I'm asking you? Have you been secretly training? Maybe. Look, a win's a win. That means we wait another hour for the mission. Ah, Neku, cut me a little slack. Not happening. I won. Therefore, we wait. Ah, uh, fine. This is a huge waste of time. Hello? This is getting to him. Keep it up, and he's bound to crack. Today, 14 players were erased, sir. Leave it to a gen- Leave it to a genius. At this rate, the game won't last a week. About that, sir? No missions have been issued in the last two days. None? None, sir. Nevertheless, players have been disappearing at a startling rate. And Minamoto? AWOL. He broke off contact yesterday. Our game master's gone missing. His so-called works of art have been sighted around the UG. Thus, I suspect he's still in the area. Then let's leave him be for now. Meaning you won't require an inquiry into Minamito's activities? Correct. He's not a social animal. Give the man some space. Understood. As you wish, Mr. Kitaniji. Any other problems? Several Reapers were attacked on Route 5, sir. We suspect taboo noise. Taboo noise. How does this affect our manpower? The losses are with intolerances. I've already said about identifying and locating the perpetrator. Very good. So the noise explain the dwindling player count. Yes, sir. I'm looking into any correlation between the two incidents now. Perfect. I'd expect no less. I leave it to you, Konishi. Understood, sir. Show Minamoto. Minamimoto. A true genius. Youngest Reaper officer in history. Tactics, intel, willpower, decisiveness, performance. His numbers are just short of Mr. Kitaniji's. Except for cooperation. A whole whopping zero. I'll admit he has talent, but his quirks are beyond control. What is he after? My analysis suggests... He's the one making rogue noise? How can you be busy, Mr. H? Your cafe is always empty! Fine, fine, sorry. Later. Uh, 
15 minutes and counting. Any minute now, Hill. Say, Neku, could you do me one teensy favor? Bingo. Now to beat him to the punch. If this is about the weight, I'm not listening. Fine. How about a trade? Right on cue. Okay, answer my question, and I'll go with you. You've twisted my arm. Go on. Shoot. What are you after? You're curious. If you don't feel like talking, we can wait. <laughs> it's nothing major. I'm going to Jack Shibuya. Right, how about a real answer? That was a real answer. What? What? How do you jack a town? That's why I'm looking for the Shibuya River. What? Shibuya River? My turn to ask a question. Do you really want a second chance? What's waiting for you in the RG? You're as alone there as here. What's the difference? <laughs> you don't have to answer. I don't really care. Now, let's get started. How's our signal today? Hmm. It's coming from our past Shiba heads. That puts it over near Utagawa? Oh, right. You knew the city well, Neku. Shibuya born and raised. My, my. It's coming from Utagawa, right? Let's go! Well, this is new. Someone's an eager beaver today. The Utagawa district. Same place I saw in your head. Along with me, lying dead on the ground. How'd I die? And who the hell are you? I might find answers there. So which way is Utagawa? Past Tipsy Toes Hall? Let me see, Tipsy Toes Hall was this way? It'd be easier if I had, like, to do where I was going. Shibuya main store. There's a east. I'm sure if I run around, eventually I'll find it. Dogenzaka. Ah! Well, now I know I'm going the right way. Bring me one sexy plus. It's a pin. Noise number 59's got them. Set my difficulty to easy. Set difficulty to easy? Crud! They're blocking my way, so now I know I'm going the right way. My pin! Give me a bird brain! There, I got my pin back. Oh, they took my sword again! No rewards for that, though. I guess I should make sure I'm actually fighting the right noise. 59, they said. Okay, it is those birds. Good 
And believe me, I'd rather be chaining these. Oh! Okay, cool! Well, here's your sexy pin. Nice. Amex. Okay. No. Yeah, now I know I'm going the right way. Pass this wall, then fight through a four reduction chain battle. If you don't care I don't care what area you fight in, but if you don't chain four rounds it won't count. Oh boy. Got it! There! Sheesh. Don't make this worse for yourself. Gotcha! Gotcha! My kid, come on! Gotcha! My kid? How's my aim? There! My kid? Yeah! Gotcha! There! Easy. That's one. Oh yeah, I'm still in easy mode, whoops. That's two. Shishi, I'm sad, may I give you a hug? Of course, Zoomer. You're always welcome to give hugs. We accept those here. Yeah, depending on how far I get with the storyline, I am dead serious about just grinding between, like, streams on this game. Because it gets ridiculous at points. It's just a sad day is all. No reason. I have... I get it. Sometimes you just feel sad on days. And that's okay. I like to think of those as days to recharge batteries. I actually prefer streaming when I'm, like, upset or not in a good mood. Whoa, what? My pen evolved! Cause like, oh god, oh god, I got so emotional. But I talk all the time about like, I, I like streaming. D streaming is definitely a pick me up for me, and so is recording too. Um, Pinivo, objective met, wall clear. Five thousand yen. I didn't know the pins could evolve. Need. So what's it do now? I should, I should, I should probably check that first. Mm -hmm. Reaper alert! Let's just report it to the police. Um, hello. We're metal and we're reapers. No way we lose all our cred. Like you have anything after boning this up? Sounds like an argument. Sounds like trouble we don't need. Let's ignore them. Let me see what the new pin do. What do the new pin do? Slash an enemy. Vulcan uppercut. No, it's very similar. Okay. Simpler and I figure... I assume evolving pins is a lot simpler than in the DS ones, at least. That's very similar. Rest in peace, then. What do you mean? I'm confused. Actually, it's easier in Switch, because, like, DS had Mingle Evolution, which was walking past other DS's. You can even play online with randos. You know what the game reminds me of? Hover. Hover's a game where you free park around the world. Ooh. That actually sounds neat. Alright. Another junk pile. The Grim Heaper strikes again. Know anyone else who put something like this together? 
There's something written on it. Any sound can shake the air, my voice shakes the heart. Uh, what? First of all, sounds don't really shake anything. I think he's saying it's better than air. Uh-huh. The tracker's responding here, but I don't think it's what we're looking for. No, no, I didn't want it. Dang it, recentering. Arg! However, since I'm me, I mostly switch. Holding to the other. <laughs> switch evolution is just fighting pins and game being off evolution. Yeah, a couple of my pins. Yeah, bigger. Hey, man, I remember you. Huh? Wait, you're that. Perfect timing. You're not busy, right? Help a brother out! Um... Sure, why not? You leave me out? Rock! Ahem, we're booked, right, Nikki? I'm sorry, but we have somewhere to be. Right, Udagawa. What? Yo, Tenho! On it. What? Uh, what? A wall? Hey! You wanna get through here? Help us out! Thrusting your personal problems on players. How very professional. Mm. Okay, that was kind of uncool. So, what's the deal? Long story short, our band's microphone's gone missing. Oh, and there's no fall damage. That would make less fun, because Broken Body is going splat from gravity. Angry Kitty Gross Radio. <laughs> Happened round two yesterday. We had a little gig at Molko, right? They unveiled a new track. Should have been no problem. But then show ends, we split for the day, and let our stuff out of sight for like one minute tops. I get back and the mic's gone. Yeah, says you. you probably just left it someplace. I'm telling you, BJ, it was stolen. The thing is deaf Mark's heart and soul. I wouldn't just lose it. Somebody took it. Who the hell would want a mic with wings? What? Hey, you lost it. Ugh, fine. Let's just split up and look for it, okay? We? Why are we looking for your junk? Screw that, man. Man, you lost it. You find it. I'm out of here. Oh, Tenho, this your phone, bro? Oh snap! I found it lying around. Thanks, man. I was wigging out trying to find it. Where was it? Oh. In the, uh, I mean, Spain Hill. I'm heading back to A East later. I'll look around Malco again. Because it's so tiny, I can find it on my own if the doctor has a hard time finding my junk. <laughs> I still don't know how this is our problem. Aw, oh, come on. Look, I'll pay you. Help us out. No way, we're here. Let me pay you before I forget. Ah, don't beat me to the draw. Oh, snap. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um. I guess I'm going to A East, because I think I know where your microphone is. Step one is gathering info, starting with the client. Honestly, Neku, this is basic stuff. Yoshi Akiryu, private dick extraordinaire. Oh, you're gonna make me talk to him about it. I'm pretty sure the guy from Ace hasn't. He's done just by being on him. <laughs> Bruh. Hey, boys, get cracking. Uh, can you give us a little more info to go on? Sure. What do you need to know? Uh, the mic itself. Describe the stolen microphone. It's a stand mic with black wings. Black wings? Yeah, it's the band symbol. <clears throat> Who'd want a bat mic? I can think of one guy. Really? Who? Freaking BJ. BJ? The guy in the black hoodie? He was just here. He didn't whine about wanting to do vocals. We had it out over that yesterday. Said he wanted to share the glory. The mic went missing right after that. Wait, he stole it because he wanted to be a vocalist? That makes no sense.
JoJo's World's End confirmed. A stando mic. So what happened when the mic was taken? I actually didn't tell you the other guys, but just before it disappeared, I got a call. Phone call? Yeah, think it back. No, it was pretty shady. Alright, tell me about the call. They didn't give their name. Just meet me by Kadoi City. We need to talk. Any guesses? Not really. Caller ID was on a public phone. Sounded like an affected voice, too. So, did you go? Yeah, but nobody was there. When I got back to Malco, the bike was gone. That uh, is shady, and you are stupid. So someone called to lure you away, and then you think the Reaper in black you were fighting with. BJ wasn't? You suspect him? As much as I hate to consider it. No more questions. I guess we're going to eight East then. Or rather, hmm. Meh, we'll keep going. Ugh, what a pain. So what now? Well, it's obvious, isn't it? Investigate the crime scene with the question people were involved. Wait, have you done this before? So we've got Malko and the two bandmates. Let's get started. Bam, fast travel would be really handy in a time like this. Hmm? Hmm? Isn't that... Let's see what he has to say. Any luck finding the mic? I'd like to ask you a few questions. Sure, whatever. A mic? 777 said the mic was the band's soul. What makes it so special? It just is. Back when we were still busking on the streets, we pulled all our money to buy it. It's our sim the symbol of our band, as a band, as friends. You're a Cheshire Cat, you teleport. I wish I could. You don't want to walk everywhere? Blasphemy! <laughs> I know, I just float. I stuck wings on it to remind us of that. It's got us through some rough times. I see. Well, lately, Triple Seven and BJ have been fighting over who gets to sing, over who has the rights to the mic. Talk about irony. You must be happy then. The object dividing them is out of the picture. Yeah. But, but I'm not happy. I just. Never mind. Got an alibi. Dead kid, why can't you go faster? <laughs> Can't you just fume out of the world? Wait, you're just your cat. You don't perform blasphemy. <laughs> I am blasphemy! <laughs> so where were you yesterday at 2 o'clock? Hmm? Right here? Are you asking us or telling us? Ah, yes. BJ said he found your phone on Spain Hill. Yeah, must have dropped it here. Well, I don't see our mic here. I'm gonna go way back by triple seven. You've been very helpful. Hmm. Well, we are gonna be investigating Mulco and figuring out what happened on the microphone in the next episode. Until then, this is Chester the Cat, signing off.